After a lot of uncertainty about the amateur side of the sport in 2020, something needed to be done. Enter Steve Brown, who had a vision. He saw an opportunity to offer a new approach. He saw the chance to provide fresh and alternative opportunities, including individual and team rankings. Great Britain would be proportioned into 16 super regions. A director in each region would oversee the development of the MAD concept by using the existing network of local leagues and competitions. Players register with MAD through their website, www.madarts.tv. There you can register a local league alongside teams and open competitions to carry MAD affiliation. There are dedicated spots in regional teams for 18 to 21 year olds, men, women and seniors. Those playing in affiliated leagues or competitions can pick up ranking points to gain themselves selection for the local region. And again, there are dedicated spots in these regional teams for 18 to 21 year olds, men, women and seniors. Players also qualify for additional opportunities in national and showpiece events through the Open Events system. MAD players in the league system can be selected for their local region, but can go one further by also representing their super region at the annual national championships, carrying a £10,000 prize fund. There is also to be a similar event for local teams. Imagine your Monday night darts team being the best in the country. National major events will invite the highest ranked players from each super region. After a lot of uncertainty about the amateur side of the sport in 2020, something needed to be done. Enter Steve Brown, who had a vision. He saw an opportunity to offer a new approach. He saw the chance to provide fresh and alternative opportunities, including individual and team rankings. Great Britain would be proportioned into 16 super regions. A director in each region would oversee the development of the MAD concept by using the existing network of local leagues and competitions. Players register with MAD through their website, www.madarts.tv. There you can register a local league alongside teams and open competitions to carry MAD affiliation. There are dedicated spots in regional teams for 18 to 21 year olds, men, women and seniors. Those playing in affiliated leagues or competitions can pick up ranking points to gain themselves selection for the local region. And again, there are dedicated spots in these regional teams for 18 to 21 year olds, men, women and seniors. Players also qualify for additional opportunities in national and showpiece events through the Open Events system. MAD players in the league system can be selected for their local region but can go one further by also representing their super region at the annual national championships, carrying a £10,000 prize fund. There is also to be a similar event for local teams. Imagine your Monday night darts team being the best in the country. National major events will invite the highest ranked players from each super region to play off for substantial prize funds and even more opportunities. MAD had its official launch event in December, where the MAD concept was formally introduced to the world. As well as the league and open events system, MAD unveiled their showpiece events and title belt system. MAD crowned five champions at the dawn, with some fantastic matches featuring some of the top amateur players within the game, including former world champion Wayne Warren, who also became the inaugural MAD world champion. In addition to the five title holders crowned at the dawn, all 16 super regions announced their inaugural champions. All would be crowned officially with a championship title belt. MAD will soon crown their inaugural women's world champion, with the title structure being exactly the same as the men's. One of the most exciting parts of modern amateur darts is its showpiece events, which offer big prize money and opportunities for the amateur player. They are the British Amateur Open, the MAD Vault, the Pub to Pro Masters, and the Golden Gauntlet. All showpiece events are accessible to MAD members by playing in the Open Events system. 
During the COVID-19 pandemic, playing traditional face-to-face -face darts has been exiled. As a result, online play began to flourish. MAD have joined this trend to offer value-for-money subscriptions, cash boosts for members in online competitions, and the MAD Virtual Team League has been introduced. MAD are expanding abroad, with the Netherlands in the process of designing their super regions and operating structure in 2021. There are plans to expand into other countries, such as Ireland, Germany, and Australia. In Great Britain, modern amateur darts are continuing to create and develop more opportunities for all amateur players.
Good evening, everybody, and welcome to MadDarts.tv. And we will be one step closer to knowing our finals lineup, the Contender Series in Bristol on the 17th of April. The England Invaders Super Regional number one contender competition has been going on throughout the day. And our final lineup Richard North taking on Jamie Kellen. Both Hampshire base players. 97. And we're underway, folks. It's a race to seven to see who will take on Rob Collins. 100. One forty. Both players very familiar with each other's game. Playing out the same Super League team. Often seen warming up together at the Challenge Tour events. Forty five. One three six. Backs up the one forty with a lovely one three six to leave tops after twelve darts. Solid open and leg from Northy. Ninety nine. Shanghai if he gets the opportunity, but for the opening throw. Two tens. Oh Jesus. Twenty. A beautiful marker with the first start, so unable to utilize that. Double tops for an early break. Yeah, and three. And a yeah, fantastic opening three-figure checkout from Jamie Kellen to punish Northy there. Sixty. Both players in terrific form, obviously, to reach this stage. One forty. Third one forty of the match already for Richard North. One eighty. And Kellen responds with the first maximum of the of the match. One forty. We've got a game on our hands here. Cracking stuff early doors. Sixty. Sixty-one. Great recovery there from Jamie Kellen. Uh, oh, Jamie. So 160 to level matters. 65. <clears throat> and he will be back because Kellen back on 174. Can only pressurise the 95. 58. Doesn't really do that. So Richard North, 95 for a level game. Wants the bullseye. Yeah, I'm free. Crack and darts there. Cheers. And we've got a level game. Two classy checkouts early. The 120 from Kellen to break throw. And North replies with a solid 95 <coughs> of his own. And a 15 dart break. 85. As we mentioned, both players in terrific form. 100. Both players been playing in the Modus Live Darts League in recent uh, days. 140. Kellen produced a stunning display on Friday at the top group N. Five 41. out of five. 
4-0 victory over England national champion Daryl Fitton. 86. Back that up with 4-1 victory over Aidy Gray. 4-2 over Diego Portella. 4-1 over Fallon Sherrick. And a 4-2 win over Barry Bates Sorry, of Wales. I think my last score was 85, actually. What was it? 57, 87, 86. 84 it was. Sorry. Change that. So, Kellen in terrific confidence boosting form coming into today. One hundred. One hundred. Ninety two left. After twelve darts. Uh, forty eight, sixty eight. Forty eight, sixty eight. Eighty eight. A great effort there at the 92. Come on. 82. Fine last start there from Kellen, but north Scored back. Wrong. 80. I don't know what's up here. 80. To take the lead for the first time. Two sixes. Yeah, first start. Right. And we've got a 2-1 lead for the man from Romsey. How will Kellen respond? 60. One forty. Relentless scoring on the 140s for Richard North here. 140. And I thought we were going to see a second maximum there from Jamie Callan responding from another 140. 100. Five 140s in three legs from Richard North. Impressive stuff. 140. And Kellen on the premises with his third of the match so far. 45. 161 after nine darts. Six darts if required. 97. So a handy 64 leave. 71. Nice ball use there with the last dart. 64 for a level game. Two 16s. 32. Ah. One three five. Pressurizes the visible. 32 for a 16 dart. Hold a throw. Yeah, in two. 17 will do nicely. Yeah. And we've got a level game, folks. Said both players familiar with each other's game. And they're bringing the best out of each other here. 140. 6 140 of the match for Richard North. One hundred. One hundred. Richard North. Richard North's route to the final: a seven-nil victory over Mitchell Webster in the last sixteen. Forty. Seven-one over Adam Judd in the quarterfinals, and a repeat seven-one scoreline against David Heath in the semi-final. Ninety-one. So, Dropping two legs in three matches shows how good of a form he is in. One, two, five. 170 going, the highest checkout on the board. 
96. Handy visit there with a treble 19. Fifty-eight. Seventy-four going to get his nose back in front. Twenty tops. Fifty-four. Kellen back on one seventy-eight, so North will be back for two tens. <laughs> Eighty. Fifteen. So for a steal, ninety-eight going for Jamie Kellen. Fifty-eight. Unable to find the treble with a first or second dart, and Richard North back for a tricky five checkout. Double two for the lead once again. In three. Very important, last dart there, secured the leg. And a 21 dart hold of throw. One forty. For Jamie Kellen, it was a slightly trickier route to the final with a 7-3 win over Andrew Quinn. In the last 16, 760 side and leg win over Peter Allen and a 7 2 victory over Mike Symes in the semi final. 60. 1 3 5. Crack and visit there from Northy. Ninety three. One forty. Yeah, another one forty there from Richard North. A very even leg. Seven one forties for Richard North in the match so far. Sixty. First row finishes Kellen on 1 for 8, but North looking to leave things handier. 58. Unable to find the treble though, so Kellen should fancy his chances in this leg. 100. 48 if he gets a chance. Utilise the bull here with the first start. Will, Rich will Richard North? He wants the ball for a 1 2 5. In three. Very yeah, impressive job, stuff. Buddy. Fantastic Very check out. <laughs> and that's the way to go on one, two, five. Brilliant stuff. Never looked like missing, to be fair. 60. Breathing space for the first time for Richard North in what is a race to seven. He's over halfway there. 97. 85. 140. As Kellen looks to respond. A break and a hold and we're back level. 58. 100. Of course, we already know two parts of our finals night in Bristol on the 17th of April. Ricky King, impressive last week. 58. The number one contender for the English national belt. Stunning victory. Over Dave Parletti of Surrey. 80. And then, of course, it was the turn of Jamie Lewis as his class prevailed. 140. 
84, go on then. Twenty-five left. Fifty-nine. So to extend his lead, he wants a hundred. Richard North. Two tops, maybe. Six then. Popular route now. If uh, the first treble goes astray, but it was also blocking the treble twenty there. Very important dart coming up here. Uh, nine. Uh, six. Double top for 5 2. Yeah, first car. Punishes. Yeah, well done. And a 5 Very 2 well. advantage for Richard North. Kellen ruined that miss there. And he's got work to do to get back in this as North goes two away from booking his place in Bristol. Richard North, of course, uh, familiar 44. on the TV screens. Two Ali Pali appearances in 2018 and 2019. 140. The 140 machine, I'm going to rename him. One hundred. His best run on TV was the last 16 appearance at the World Grand Prix on his debut year of getting his tour card in 2017. Ten one forties from Richard North in the match. Prolific stuff. Eighty seven. One hundred. So one three four to go one away. Great set up there from Northy. Kellen needs this. Treble 19. Uh, 133. Three. Another great set up, but relying on Richard North to miss on one of his favourite doubles. Two nines for 6 2. In three. Classy double yeah, nine. A tricky yes. double in general, but when you're 5 2 up, they tend to go in. And he's one away from being the number one contender of the English invaders. 50. As mentioned, Northey reached the one final minute. of a Pro Tour event, being edged out by Dave Chisnell on his debut year, which set up that World Grand Prix appearance. He's also made appearances... In One, the latter two, stages three. of the UK Open and Players Championship. One eighty. Second maximum of the match from Jamie Kellen. And he'll need a few more of them if he's to get back in this game. Fifty eight. Fifty eight. Ninety six. One, two, five going for Jamie Kellen after nine darts. One hundred. Treble twenty double top. Sixty one. So what a way this would be to end the match. One seventy going. Not this time. One three four. Sets things up beautiful with two treble nineteens yeah. to leave double eighteen. 64 to remain in the match. Yeah, and two. Brilliant oh, leg of darts. A 14 dart. Cheers, mate. Break a throw. To remain in the match. One forty. Kellen really stepping on the gas now, but is it too late? 99.47 average for Richard North. 100. 87 for Kellen. Cracking darts on both players. 
60. One hundred. One hundred. One eighty. There's Richard North's first yeah. maximum of the match. The third in total to back up is ten one forties. Sixty. Ah, fifty-seven. Treble seventeen there for the bullseye was required, but unfortunately came up dry. One four one to remain in mm. it. Can only set things up now. Yeah, great up. Thirty. And has he blown his chances? Because Richard North sixty-four for the match. Double top. Ah, uh, 44. To remain in the match. Lucky. 111 going. Yeah, in three. And another classy oh, class checkout to end the match. Class. There we have it, folks. The Contender Series. Oh, Sixty. Jamie Kellen cracking darts. Getting way too excited here. Eighty-five. Fifty-eight. A One twenty checkout and a hundred and eleven from Jamie Kellen in the match so far. One forty. Ninety-six. One forty. A break a throw here, and we'll be back on throw. Eighty-four. One three six. Eighty-two. Lovely last treble nineteen there, and he will be back for fifty-four with North back on two 59. or three. So fifty-four for a six-five. Double top. Yeah, and three. And from six-two, yeah, it is now six-five. Everybody. Yeah, mate. As Richard North has been one away for quite some time, but Kelling has responded fantastically well. What a match. Here at modernamateradarts.tv. I really can't wait for 100. finals night. As mentioned, the Welsh belt on the line. Jamie Lewis taking on Jim Williams. One eighty. Richard North with the second maximum of the match. As he looks to end matters without it going the distance. Uh, 60. Ah, oh, 45. Daryl Fitton against Ricky King. Rob Collins against who? We're very close to finding out. 100. And of course, tomorrow, a £60 entrance fee for the World Championship number one contendership to take on Wayne Warren. Yay. Still time to enter that, folks, ahead of tomorrow's big event. 100. One, three, four. Yeah. Beautiful visit there to leave 84. Kellen to remain in things. Treble 19. 89. 
So 84 for the match. With Kellen sat on 52. Ah, 25 left. Bullseye would have secured the match. So Kellen back for a level game. And who would have thought that 10 minutes ago? Double top for a level game. Yeah, in three. And a perfectly yeah, weighted well, last you. start. All the best, buddy. And we're yeah, going well, the distance. We don't bet up again, do we? Oh, a one oh, leg shootout. Oh, yeah, okay. All the best, mate. I don't know. To be the England Invaders number one contender. <laughs> Just go. I don't know what we're yeah. doing. Just go for it. Well, I guess now as we board up at the start. Yeah, yeah. Go okay. for it. The all important right. bull won by mate. Richard North at the start of the match. Gives him the advantage in the deciding leg. And it really is a shame to be a loser in this one. A credit to both players. 100. Both winners in my eyes. I certainly look forward to seeing a lot more of Jamie Kellen 85. in the future. Classy player. It's great to see Richard North finding his form again. A real character. 140. Yet another 140 from Richard North. As he looks to hold throw to win the match. 100. One forty. Good odds. Yes. Fifty nine. For a twelve dart match winning visit. Eighty-one. Lovely setup. That. Didn't yeah. need to go the bull route with Jamie Callum being back on two five seven, so he'll be back for tops. One three seven. Yeah, great, great visit there to pressurise. Double top for the match for Richard North. Two nineteens. Lovely marker. M three. The Whoa. marker <laughs> made it pay. Lucky, Fantastic lucky last start. With last Kellen start. sat back Thank on 120. Oh, mate, that was lucky. A very close game. Fantastic stuff. Credit to both players, as mentioned. A deciding leg, sh a deciding leg shootout. And there is the tail of the tape, everybody. A 96 average. 12 140s, two 180s apiece, a 125 checkout. But what a very nerveless double 19 to win the match. And we now know that Richard North will take on Rob Collins for the England Invaders Super Regional title in Bristol on April the 17th. Please join us for that on maddarts.tv. Thank you very much for joining us tonight. We'll see you all soon.